I was born in Centralia, Washington, a town of about 10,000 today, small rural area halfway between Seattle and Portland. My father, he had started a uh, radio station there when he graduated from college. He had come to town and had no money, so he got a couple people to put up money and give him part of the station. He was entirely too trusting, and other people continually took all his money or cheated him and deceived him in spite of his uh, abilities. In the third grade, teachers began noticing that Craig was having problems in school. He was diagnosed as suffering from dyslexia. One of the things about dyslexia is it makes it very difficult to communicate with people who are very literal because the way the brain works or it processes information is different. And so it makes me uncomfortable and um, ill at ease when I'm dealing with people who can't process what I'm trying to say. So I participated less in other activities. I lived more within myself. And I had to study more hours and work harder to get the same thing done. Things changed dramatically for the family when Craig's father met with an accident. One night um, he was hit by a drunk driver and was nearly killed. And he was left fairly crippled by that. It led, I think, in ultimate part to his having a heart attack uh, some 11 years later. I happened to have been home alone and no member of the family was anywhere nearby, so I went through the experience of uh, finding him. And uh, so I would have to say it was a dramatic effect on me. His father's death left the family in emotional and financial turmoil. It was dramatic, the awesome difficulties that uh, it left for my mother. So she became consumed with trying to fend off the creditors and prevent them from uh, embarrassing us terribly in the community, etc. And she did everything she could, but uh, it, it took her away from us and certainly was very uh, emotionally draining to her. After graduation from college, Craig decided to follow in his father's footsteps and work in the cable TV industry. His motivation for success was as much personal as financial. Somehow or another, um, it seemed terribly important to sort of get back the family pride. Walk on the pier. Craig always wants to do right in business and in personal life and in, in every aspect of his life. He wants to be um, true, moral, and fair. For me, it's almost a matter of trying to prove that you can do business, be good to people, share with people oh, yeah, a lot, oh, and proving that you can be nice.